Hey guys, haven't made a video yet tonight, and I um, am going to make a quick and easy dinner, so I figured I'd record it. Why not? Okay, so I'm going to have uh, cheaters, chicken, and noodles. Don't mind the messiness. Everywhere in this house is messy right now. Anyways, uh, quick and easy, simple, cheaters, chicken, and noodles. Are you ready? Okay. All right, we're going to do it in the Instant Pot. Um... I've never made it with this before, so we're gonna, hopefully it will work. So, rolled and ready, chicken fillets, um, ramen egg noodles, cream of chicken, and chicken stock. If you guys wanna know how to make um, noodles, like egg noodles from scratch, I, I do make the best uh, egg noodles. All right, so I have two chicken breasts in there. Um, okay, I've got um, cream of chicken in there on top of it. Now the egg noodles. I'm just gonna dump them in. Chicken stock. Are you guys painting pumpkins? Yeah. Yeah? Cece, what's all over your face? <laughs> so we did our own makeup today, huh? We Okay, while I wait for that to go, I'm going to check on chicken eggs. And now it is starting to rain. Fun, fun, fun. Isn't my house pretty? How you guys doing? <laughs> now that it's finally up to pressure. That took forever. And what kind of easy meal wouldn't be best with an easy side? Instant mashed potatoes. Quick and easy. And actually these are really good. So. So I really wanted some peas to go with this, but we're out of peas and I didn't see anything else that would really look good with it. Man, my house is a mess. <laughs> Y'all. I hope you guys aren't judging this messy house because, I mean, it is what it is when you've got five kids and there are little tornadoes running around. Anywho. Pressure on that finally stopped. So let's see how it turned out. So I took the chicken out. I'm gonna shred it with just two forks. Now it's shredded. It was more liquidy than I liked, so I pulled some of the broth out. I'm going to thicken it up with some flour. product super yummy all the dogs want some <laughs> I'm missing the peas I need some green on that plate but you know I think I'll be okay for tonight it's pretty good my uh, chicken and noodles from scratch is better but for a quick easy um, chicken and noodle fix. This is good. I don't think I'll use this chicken again. I don't like the way it's seasoned, but it's not horrible. What do you think about it? It's good. 
when you eat it again. Yeah. <laughs> You're what? like, I can't say no to that anyway. Uh, there's nothing you've made that I don't like. <laughs> Hi, Shiloh. <laughs> Shiloh says, I want some of those chicken and noodles. Right? Hope you guys enjoyed that quick and easy recipe. Um, super easy to make, especially if you don't have time to make... Um, you know, um, homemade chicken and noodles. So I love chicken and noodles. It's one of my favorite things to eat, um, comfort food. You can do the same recipe actually. Um, if, you, if you wanted like beef and noodles, you could do the same thing. Most grocery stores have like a uh, pre-cooked roast that you can get. Like I think Bob Evans has like a, a pre-cooked roast. Um, I think that's the brand. I've had one of them. They're not bad, they're kind of dry. Um, but I mean it would work for noodles. Um, so just, yeah, replace the chicken with the roast and then the chicken broth, replace that with beef broth and then there you go. Same thing. So yummy. I like beef better than chicken usually, but there's something about chicken noodles that I just love. I love my chicken noodles from scratch. Um, probably should make a recipe here for you guys to see that too. Um, but yeah. So let me know what you guys want to see. I'm uh, running out of ideas for videos. <laughs> and I'm only one weekend to this challenge. So let me know what you guys want to see. And I'll do my best to put it out there. Come back tomorrow and I wonder what we're going to do tomorrow. I don't know. I'll see you then. Talk to you guys later. Bye.